What is going on, everybody? My name is Jake with Code 4 Defense, and I'm here in the shop talking about what I think is the best dry fire training that you can get at home. So the main program that we're going to be talking about is a program called dryfireonline.com. And full disclaimer, I haven't been paid or endorsed by dry fire or any of the products that I'm about to show you. I just have been using them in my dry fire regiment over the past three months while it's been winter here in Iowa and giving me a chance to get faster, get better, um, all in the comfort of my basement where it's not negative 30 outside. So what is dryfireonline.com? Well, it is a web-based computer application that works in conjunction with a phone or a tablet application to provide you with an extremely realistic dry fire training experience at home. So the way it works is you navigate to the website and you set up essentially a stage of fire. And so what that means is you select your background, be it a concrete hall or a canyon or whatever you want to choose. And then you set your target out to whatever distance you're trying to work on. And you're able to fire a laser at the screen. And then the phone records that screen and shows you where your shot placement was when you came out of the holster and fired that shot. And um, even more impressive, the program comes with a shot timer. So it gives you that initial beep. And then when you come and you fire that first shot, it gives you a uh, time in the top right corner of the screen that shows you how fast you were out of the holster. And then it records again where that shot placed on your target so you can see how accurate you were. It even allows you to adjust for offsets, like say you're training cartridge or your laser system isn't as accurate as what your sights are, it allows you to adjust for that offset so that you can be as accurate as possible. So what are the different ways that you can access this program and use it? Well, in my opinion, the best way to utilize this program is with a projector and some type of projecting surface. So the way that I've been doing this at home um, is with a uh, standard LED projector. They run anywhere from 150 to you know, $200, $300 on Amazon. They can be had anywhere from that range depending on the features that you're looking for. And then I use a uh, projector screen that's 100 inches that the projector uh, casts its image onto. Now, you can use any screen that you want to. Say you wanted to use a screen like the one that I've got in the background there. That's completely fine. But I found that the larger 100 inch screen from the projector makes it extremely realistic when you go to use this program. So after you um, set up your, uh, however you're gonna access the program, I connect my computer to my projector, go online and I access the program that way. Once I project that image, there's several ways that you can now use a um, laser trainer to project the image or to project the laser onto the screen for it to record. The cheapest and most cost-effective solution would be to use a laser training cartridge that fits in the bore of your gun. So this is a Smith & Wesson CSX, one of their new Micro 9 carry guns. And inside of it, there is a laser cartridge that's a snap cap. And when I pull the trigger on this, it is going to fire a laser out the bore of the gun. And the application records that on the screen when you uh, start the program up and running. So the nice thing about this is even at the just most bare bones essential way of doing this, I've got this nine millimeter cartridge, which fits my 380 caliber guns, my nine millimeter guns. And now, although I have to recock the gun every time I wanna to go to fire, what this is great for is doing things like first shots out of the holster. So say you've got a new concealed carry rig or you just wanna get faster coming up out of the holster on target and getting that first clean trigger press. Well, this allows you to do that really well. It gives you the beep, it allows you to draw, get up on target, place that first shot, and then it tells you the time that it took you to do that. So then you can, the program automatically resets and you're able to set back up, get your gun back in your holster, and you're able to work again that same type of thing. So even at the most bare bones way that this system works, it's fantastic for um, training in terms of working with the holster, working on coming up on sites, getting that clean trigger press that you're looking for, and getting just overall faster at that. Another thing that this works great for when you're using just a single laser cartridge is by working with something like this Smith & Wesson MMP 2.0 that has a red dot on top of it. So if I'm new to the red dot game or I wanna get faster at acquiring the dot on a target, um, I can use that laser cartridge, come up and on target, find my dot and get that clean trigger press and just work, just work that over and over again on the beat, coming up, 
getting my dot and getting that first clean trigger press so that I can get faster at acquiring that dot, bring down my um, initial shots on target times. The absolute best way to use this system though, in my opinion, is with another product. And again, I haven't been paid or endorsed or um, given any money to bring you this product. In fact, I paid for this all on my own so that I could get better dry fire training practice at home is something called the Cool Fire Trainer. So this is a standard Glock 34 and inside of it is a barrel that replaces the standard barrel and recoil mechanism that you would find in the Gen, 3, Gen 4 Glock 34. So once that barrel is replaced, there is a CO2 based system that works a piston that when you pull the trigger, the piston cycles the slide and resets the trigger every time. So this thing is charged, ready to go. I'm gonna pull the trigger and it's gonna fully cycle the slide, reset the trigger, and I'm ready to fire another shot. Now the cool thing about this is this device here on the end is a laser. So just like that laser cartridge, every time I pull the trigger, it's gonna fire a laser out the muzzle of the handgun. And now I can do things like fire just as fast as I can pull that trigger and the application, the phone or tablet based application is recording, recording the screen, recording where the shots are hitting. And so now I've got something that is about 90% there when it comes to training in my own home. I mean, the only thing that this doesn't give me is the full recoil of a nine millimeter and the bang that goes along with the gun going off. I would say the recoil on this is um, probably a little more than a 22, again, less than a nine millimeter, but enough that you have to pay attention to your grip so that you can get faster follow-up shots on target. The other thing that this system allows you to do because it recoils the gun for you, allows you to uh, practice reset on recoil with your trigger. So one of the things that I've been working on this winter um, to get my split times down even more, get faster uh, firing on the trigger is something called reset on recoil. And what that means is when I go to fire the gun, I automatically place my trigger finger back at the wall of the gun. So I'm gonna fire and it's reset, ready to go for the next shot. So as opposed to firing and pinning the gun back to the rear and then allowing it to recoil or allowing it to reset after, I'm gonna just reset while the, while the slide is reciprocating and the gun is recoiling. So that allows you to get faster double shots or faster follow-up shots on target. And it just makes you an overall faster shooter. The next thing that this system allows you to do that you would never be able to do in traditional dry fire practice is working with a red dot on a handgun. So this is a Hollow Sun 508T and it has a uh, you know standard red dot on it. But the thing that you can't do with standard dry fire training, um, when I go to pull that trigger, I have to rack the slide and then I have to get back up on target. Well, this allows me to track the dot as it's recoiling. So something that I would never be able to do uh, other than at the range with live ammunition, I can now practice following that dot as the slide recoils and getting back on target quicker so that I can get faster follow-up shots on target. Another thing that this system allows you to do that works really well in dry fire practice is working on your reloads. So inside of this magazine, there's actually a little plastic um, half bullet that depresses the um, follower far enough that it doesn't activate the slide stop lever. So this is a standard magazine, empty, that when you fire it, it's gonna lock the slide back to the rear. You can then work on dropping that magazine and performing um, either a slide stop reload or working on performing, getting in, coming over the top and getting back on target. Uh, essentially just working your reload drills so that you can get your reload time down, get back on target, and actually have some follow through firing multiple shots after you get that reload down. In addition to working with things like the Cool Fire Trainer, there's also another device called the, uh, it's actually from a company called Laser Shot, and it works with an airsoft gun with a 14 millimeter negative counterclockwise screw that threads onto the front of an airsoft gun like this Tokyo Marui airsoft rifle. And the cool thing about this rifle is that uh, it actually has recoil. So when I go to fire it, I can pull the trigger and every time I pull the trigger, it fires a laser out the front of it and it works uh, so that I can work on things like rifle up drills. So I can work on coming from something like a high ready 
a low ready coming up to target. I can work on things like high carry coming up to target or um, more of like a sewel position coming up on target. I can work things like height over bore offset, working on CQB type targets. And a um, platform like this, uh, when it's on an empty magazine, it actually goes to a bolt stop. So you have to take this magazine out, insert a fresh magazine and drop the bolt before I can start firing the gun once more. So let's talk about the elephant in the room on this thing. What does all of this cost and is it worth it for you to invest in, in, a, in a system like this or a series of systems like this to work on dry fire training at home? Well, the short answer in my opinion is it's absolutely worth the cost, excuse me, worth the cost. And we'll get into the breakdown of all of that right now. So the Dry Fire Online uh, program costs $5 a month, and there's actually a tiered system as to what you want, but I'm here to tell you that you wanna pay for the most expensive, um, the most expensive variant of those offerings. And the reason for that is it gives you 50 shots per round that you um, set for your stage, it gives you your shot timer, your split times, your overall time, everything that you could want um, for, for your dry fire training. And for $5 a month, I think that's 100% worth it in my opinion. I did have Dry Fire Online reach out to me after posting several videos on our Instagram account of me using, using this system throughout the winter. And they offered a coupon code to any of my uh, viewers so that you can get a discount on, I think it's the first three months or something like that. I'll put a link down below to what it actually gets you and what the coupon code is. Now, again, I had been using this program well before they reached out to me and I've continued to pay for it on my own because I think that it's an extremely good product. It works really well for what it is. The stage builder that you get into, you can build literally any stage you can think of. And I'll play some videos now, but there's things that I've made where it's like moving circles so that you have to work on, you know, following the circle and getting a shot on target. You even have to leave it a little bit. There's things where you can work on like random target presentations. So um, there'll be several targets that pop out of walls and they're shoot, no shoot versions of those targets. And it's different every time the beat goes. So you can work on uh, identifying your threat, getting up on target, addressing that threat or multiple threats. Um, you can work on setting up IDPA stages, like uh, one of the ones that I have is uh, called Go Fast, which is a series of rectangles with a um, circle in the middle. So you have to fire two on each, come back to that circle. So you can work on like standard stages. So say you wanna get really, uh, you wanna work on something and get noticeably better at it or improve over time. You can set that up and then you can save 20 of those stages to your profile so that you can work on specific things every time or you can work for a month on one specific thing and try and get more and more proficient at it as time goes on. So $5 a month, I think that's 100% worth it. Now the projector that I got was $200 and the screen that I got was I think around $80. Now I can tell you the easy way that I sold that to my family is doing movie nights out in the backyard, projecting that uh, onto the screen in the backyard. It's been absolutely fantastic for that purpose. It just so happens that I also get a dry fire practice with it. So again, about 200 bucks, another 80 for the projector or for the screen, you're looking probably anywhere from 300 to 350 for that setup itself. I assume that you have a computer at home and probably a smartphone. So those things I'm gonna not figure into this cost, but obviously that is another factor as well. Now the cool fire trainer system for everything out the door, meaning you get the um, fill bottle, the 20 ounce CO2 fill bottle. You get the extended shot with the laser that allows you to quick fill and the barrel, which works only for one of your gun setups, but you know, choose the gun that you're going to practice with the most. In my case, I wanted to get better at this particular platform. So I purchased it for the Gen 4 Glock 34. Um, that system out the door costs around $550 shipped to your door. Now the lead time on that is lengthy. I think it's like six weeks right now. And it took, I think around six weeks to get mine. But I can tell you for $550, we'll call it $900 out the door if you're including the projector and the screen and everything else that you need. For $900, you can get, no joke, the absolute best dry fire experience that you can get in your own home um, at that price point. Now you can spend you know, $3,500, $4,000 or more on some of the more impressive 
uh, virtual ranges and stuff. But for me, for what I've been able to accomplish over the winter in terms of getting better at just strict firearm fundamentals, nine hundred dollars was a it was a very worthwhile investment in my opinion. And if you break that down, um, it's probably in today's prices two thousand rounds of ammo, or you know even a little less than that, depending on where you're buying your ammo from. So the fact that uh, this bottle right here allows me to pull the trigger on that system 3,000 times before I have to fill it, and it only cost me $4 at my local Shields to refill this thing. I have four of these tanks, so I go and fill them up for $4, and I take them home, and it lasts me over a month um, of dry fire training with 3,000 rounds a shot for each of those things. I can tell you I have pulled the trigger on this system no less than 20,000 times, and that is not an over-exaggeration. If anything, it's an under-exaggeration. So for $900, being able to pull the trigger 20,000 times and actually get good quality target recognition, shots on target, working on things like red dot fundamentals, trigger press fundamentals, reset on recoil, um, being able to do things like transition drills, multiple targets, addressing multiple targets. I just can't even describe how cool the system is, to be honest. It, it is absolutely worthwhile. So would I say at the end of all of that, it's it's worth it? 1000%. It's been an absolutely fantastic training tool while I've been, you know, kind of stuck inside on some of these negative 30 degree days when it's been snowing quite a bit here in Iowa this year. Now, the cool thing too is even as the warm season comes, I'm still going to be using this system because all I have to do is walk down to my basement flip on the computer, turn on my projector, and I'm training within five minutes as opposed to driving to the range and having to deal with all of that setup. I'm getting good quality training on a firearm platform that I use all the time, and I can do it within five minutes in my own home. So to me, that's, that's an absolute win and something that's extremely impressive, to be honest with you. Now, one other thing that I wanted to bring up is I've discussed several um, firearm training theories and just um, firearm tactic theories and stuff like that. Now that's not something I've done on the channel before. So I wanted to give you a little bit of a disclaimer on that. Anytime you hear anything about firearms theory or training online, I mean, take that with a grain of salt. Understand that these are the things that I find important when it comes to my training. And carrying a gun is something that's a personal responsibility. So at the end of, at the, end of the day, whatever you train and however you train it, you're gonna be personally responsible for that when it comes time to either use those skills or not. Um, so everything that I've talked about, take with a grain of salt. I, um, I do this stuff professionally outside of all of this. And so these again are things that I find important for me for when I carry a gun um, out in the real world to make sure that I'm proficient if it ever came time to use something like that. So if you have any questions about the system, if you um, just wanna comment about it, it's, it's an extremely, interesting system. It's an extremely impressive setup once you get everything running. Uh, please leave them in the comments below. I'm more than happy to help you with anything. Again, check the links down below for the coupon code that Dry Fire Online sent to me. And I've also uh, sent links to several of the stages that you've seen in the video here so that you can just get right in running on some of the stages that I've been run running, some of the stages that I've been practicing with. As always, stay safe and uh, we'll see you on the next one.